No new side quest by uh, well, talking. Yeah, so it looks like we're headed to the hospital, then back to the uh, Spectre place. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All proceeds from today's purchases go towards the Turian War effort. I think, guys. Lovely idea. Let's see. Her husband's a Krogan. Really? Nothing from these people? Oh, here we go. Which one? Where, who's saying it? That guy. Damn it, the Alliance needs that thing right now. So we're getting a lot of these uh, things that we can scan the planets for. Which is fine, we need the war assets. And finally, anyone over here. You want my security bids, bring me a warrant. You're stonewalling me? Those bids could be vital to the war. I doubt the Reapers have agents doing business in my cafe. We're trying to protect you. That's the job you do. See those scorch marks? Cerberus killed one of my servers right there. Where were you? Hey, I lost friends too. But if you care about finding the Cerberus informants who made it happen, you'll give me the vids. I agree, give him the vids. We're at war. If you care about the safety of the Citadel, you'll help CSEC however you can. Thank you, Commander. I have some high-profile customers. If word gets out that I'm ratting them out Alright, Paragator. Thanks for stopping by, man. I am definitely enjoying it, yes. I'm after the bastards who attack the Citadel. Nobody else. You've got my word on it. Alright. Just... I hope it helps. Alright, cool. So they got the videos to uh, hopefully find some more of the, the Leaper agents. Anyone down here? Nope. Alright, so hospital time for Thane, and then possibly the Batat, and there is someone down at the cargo place. Nurse. Ugh. Alright, we're at the hospital. Recognized. Please select the destination. One moment, there. Please. See how he's doing? They're saying uh, he needed the blood, and his son had the blood, obviously. Hopefully, he got there in time. We'll see. I mean, he is dying of the disease, anyway. Let's see if he made it through, though. Get that thing. He was basically living at the hospital before this, anyway. Spoken to Liara. Ooh, you know what? I did miss Liara there. Crap. So I have to go back there. I didn't see her. I walked all around. I didn't see her at all. Keep picking up these side quests. Here. Uh, I did talk to her before, yes. Hot water and everything. And that's when Neyra came. Neyra was another huntress on your ship? Yeah. A friend. I, I wanted it to be more than that, but she had a... Medical condition. It's okay. It's in the file. The farm girl calls in to me that another Asari is here. I thought the shuttle had gotten back early. They come out in a towel and. and Neyra walks through the door. But it wasn't her. Not anymore. Mm. You think there's something missing? Gotta yeah, wait for this. Over here first. There's got to be something. I don't know what Cerberus was packing, but we're going to lose this patient. Without a new treatment plan, we're stuck. Chemical treatment. I can't treatment. think of anything beyond what we've already tried. I know. 
But I can't think of anything else. Can you? Being a lot of these little side quest things. Mostly war asset type of stuff, but still. On capture card, don't do that. Nothing here. All the rooms. I understand Caliban is very busy, but this is one of your own generals. He was stabbed with a poison blade by a Cerberus soldier during the attack. Terry and poison. We can't identify the toxin. We're barely keeping him alive right now. It's some form of neurotoxin. If you could look at our charts. Of course, I understand. Even a general is just one man. Good luck. Interesting. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. Can I help you? I'm Alcatraz looking for a drill yet? named Krios. Well, we have a drill, but not under that name. He was injured. Stab wound. He's a regular patient here. It's all right, it's all right. I see. The doctors were able to repair a lot of the trauma. However, Mr. Hmm. Krios is in the final stages of Keppel syndrome. At its worst, Keppel syndrome interferes with his blood's ability to carry oxygen. And he lost a lot. Now they've given him transfusions, but frankly, there was a very limited supply of Drell blood on the Citadel. I'll get more. Give me his blood type. That's not going to work. Only one other Drell on the station is a match, and that Drell is in with him now. We did all we could to help him through surgery, but his body can't replace lost blood with new cells. Too much shock. His son, Koliat, he's in there saying his goodbyes. You might want to say yours. Damn. Commander Shepard, my father mentioned you were no longer incarcerated. I don't know if you remember me. I'm Koliak Krios. I came to donate blood and, well, he asked me to take off his oxygen mask so he could be comfortable. I don't think it will be very long. Your father helped me save a lot of lives. I'd like to be here. Of course. Commander, I'm afraid I won't be joining you again. You've done more than enough, Vane. That assassin should be embarrassed. A terminally ill Drell managed to stop him from reaching his target. I'll pass the word along. <laughs> There is something I must do before it gets worse. I must... <coughs> Galahira, mistress of inscrutable depths, I ask forgiveness. Galahira, whose waves wear down stone and sand. Galahira, wash the sins from this one and set him on the distant shore of the infinite spirit. <coughs> Koyad, you speak as the priests do. You have been spending time with them. I brought a prayer book. Commander, would you care to join me? Kalahira, this one's heart is pure, but beset by wickedness and contention. Guide this one to where the traveler never tires, the lover never leaves, the hungry never starve. Guide this one, Kalahira, and he will be a companion to you as he was to me. something I don't understand. His last moments were those of a hero. Why pray for salvation? The prayer was not for him, Commander. He has already asked forgiveness for the lives he has taken. His wish was for you. 
Goodbye, Fame. You won't be alone long. Damn. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. We help our patients, all of them. That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. I've seen this happen in combat before. And we will run out of supplies. Have you seen the projections the administration center made? I have. The situation is going to get worse. What's your point? We can't deny the facts. If we prioritize them, some of our patients are in a much better position to survive. If we take care of them first and ration <sighs> our supplies, we can save some now and enable ourselves to save more later. We cannot do that. We swore an oath to help the sick regardless of their economic situations or their places in society. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. We help our patients, all of them. That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. Which I've option do I choose? Fuck. This and one I'm torn about. Run out of supplies. I mean, have it makes sense to prioritize. I have. Welcome back, old school. Worse. What's your point? I don't know. It makes sense to prioritize everything. But it's kind of a dick move. If we take care of them I mean, first, she's talking about combat price, scenario, and this is a combat scenario. To save more later. We it's gonna piss that. people off, though. Fucking piece of society. shit. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. Uh, we our patients, all of them. That's I've got to be nice. But it won't help when we run out of We're fighting right now to protect the people you're talking about. If you let these people die, that fight is for nothing. Yep. It's not that simple. If we aren't careful about this now, we'll end up losing everyone. Then we'll find a way. Look, we have more fortunate patients, right? Yes. And I hate to say it, but the fortunate ones have far better survival odds. <laughs> and more credits. So we ask them for donations. To get more supplies. For those without credits. What? Yes. Are you saying what I think you're saying? That's... You know, that, that actually might work. Yeah, I'm right. Very nice. Good decision. I don't know what that guy's doing, he's weird. This is where Ashley was. And of course, they have people laying on the floor, but no, let's not use that room right there. Uh, I wasn't there. Alright, so I did miss talking to Liara at the uh, Presidium there. Let go back and do that. And we'll go to the ship and talk to everyone on the ship. <laughs> We've got a lot of talking to do. Which is really half of Mass Effect. Which I'm fine with. Uh, so yeah, the commons. I don't know how I missed her, because I like it. I went everywhere, so. I don't know. Definitely getting hungry though. Cooked some bacon yesterday in the frying pan. If anyone cooks bacon in a frying pan, it like quadruples the amount of oil. So I have a lot of bacon grease that I saved for tonight. I'm making some steaks. I'm gonna cook it in bacon grease. That'd be awesome. I am so ready for that. As soon as I get done streaming, I'm immediately gonna slow cook that steak in the bacon grease. USA, USA, USA. <laughs> Basically, I am ready for that. These emotional feels, though. All right, so where was she at? They always at six. All right, how did I miss her? Round here, down here somewhere. I totally missed her as this just keeps ripping out here. It's that blue thing. No. Where is Liara? Not her. Oh, that's a lovely idea. I really appreciate management doing it. My husband's away on duty right He's now. He's a robber. I don't know. Oh, you're bonded with Turian? No, actually, my husband's a Krogan. Oh, well, that's great. With her Excuse and me. another character I'm here. Sorry. You need to hear this. I don't remember. Uro 
house of Ilium. If these humble words reach you, then I have joined my ancestors. No. No, no, no. My dream was to be by your side, a weed beside your beauty, twining together in the warm Tachanka sun. Oh, Char. But if my last days must be with Krant, instead of kindness, still I will remember the perfume of your scent and the soft touch of your petals. <sighs> Let my broken bones build a wall around your garden so you and the flower we planted together can grow safe and strong. Yeah, this is off my Krogan, dude. I should... I need to go. You are serving the galaxy, soldier. So tonight, let us serve you. Great. Where the hell is she? Alright, this is all considered six over here as well. She might be over here. Somewhere. Oh, that's her. I passed her and it didn't... Okay. Hello, Shepard. Nice to see you. I missed this place. It's good to be off ship for a while. Hello again. Hello, Shepard. Nice to see you. Yeah. Nothing there. Alright. Now, uh, we go to the nurse who is in the docking bay or something. What was it called? Holding area. Nurse. I'm missing something? Really? Uh, I know there was something with the Shadow Broker with the, uh, bank teller up here that I did. Alright, yeah. I mean, I'll, I'll see. I mean, I, I try to talk to everyone, so... Well, we'll definitely be back here talking to everyone again. There's a lot of stuff. So there's a nurse. We are at another character in the cafe. Uh, I think that's where I did talk to her. I don't remember what it was, so it might have been that. I mean, I know I talked to her before in the Presidium. I think she was in the cafe. I just don't really remember what it was about and whatnot. Right, so where's this nurse at? Seven. So she's the first one right over here. So she's watching over the Batarian. Pressure's okay. No infection so far. And by she, I mean he. Can I talk to him? Only if it's important, Commander. He's hurt bad. Take down the sedative a bit, but hurry. I peg his survival at 50 50. Are you Gorek? <sighs> Not even what a terrorist is doing on the Citadel? Get away from me, human! He didn't answer my question. Your alliance wiped out my world. Blew up a relay that turned my planet into ash. I got had people on it. Families. Struck back. The Alliance destroyed the Alpha Relay because the Reapers were about to come through. Easy for you to say that now that... <laughs> you want to punish me? Unplug the sedative. <laughs> Let me join my family. Mm. Now it's weird. He said you want to punish me. And yet he clearly wants it to happen, though. Ah, fuck. I'm not gonna kill him.
I'm done here. Good. He'll cough himself to death without a sedative. No! Wait! I... My bad. Alright. Just take it easy. Oh. There. I thought he was saying, like, I'm not gonna give him a sedative, he's gonna cough to death. Okay. Peaceful death. Peaceful death. Alright. Good decision again. <laughs> Alright, so go to the ship now. No way to get there from here, though. Cortez and James, yeah. Wait, Cortez. Yeah, never mind. I was like, why is he here? Mem Memorial Wall. That's right. Alright, so we go to the ship and we'll talk to everybody again. Spectre status recognized. Please select the destination. One moment. Damn right, Spectre status recognized. Better recognize this. We'll see if Ashley's back on the ship too. I'm gonna assume that she is, but uh, you know. Oops. Got a bunch of stuff to do with the planets. I think most of that's just scanning and whatnot. It's not actual missions to do. No one's here, right? Nope. Back to Normandy. Another cutscene. Oh, okay. Miranda. Commander. That Miranda. We need to talk before you ship out. Things got pretty crazy. I'm trying to go over everything in my head. Make sense of it. I mean, I know why she was helping Undine, but all right. Your bandages were still fresh. How did you end up working with Adina? You saw me in the hospital. I was going crazy. Felt like I was letting everyone down. When Udina offered to make me a specter, I thought it was a chance to do some good. I couldn't just sit back and watch either. Yeah, but it sure turned into a mess. You followed your instincts and kept a clear head. Doesn't feel that clear-headed now. We stopped Adina and got to walk away. That's the important part. I can't believe he was responsible for all of it. Was he indoctrinated? It's hard to say. How do we fight something that can worm its way into your head? I don't know. But we don't have a choice. No, we don't. I also wanted to tell you, Hackett offered me a position on his team. Want to talk about this? <laughs> Hackett, really? Well... Fuck him, you're coming with us. Would you consider riding this out aboard the Normandy? You're serious? We need the best, Williams. Okay, Commander. I'm in. Good. Grab your gear. I'll do that. And Williams? Yeah? Keep your gun pointed at the Reapers. <laughs> Will do, Commander. <laughs> 